Now, what kind of RV is this? Camper Van Kevin here. Well, you guessed it. I finally got out on the road. I've got a friend that lives over in Alabama that was in a bad car wreck. Uh, she's been on the mend. I've known her for a long time, but I haven't seen her in a long time, so I thought I'd go say hello. And I'm in a town, I just got out of Mentone, Alabama, E M E N T O N E, across the mountain. I'm now headed north on. Uh, US 11 and uh, you know I always like trying to find interesting things on the road and I've passed by a bunch but I had to turn around and come back to see this okay you got to see it kind of give you a pan around pan around where I'm at I just come through some beautiful mountains uh, I got off on highway 75 went west here we go and now I just have crossed over from Georgia to Alabama. Oh, here's my RV. Tucker, you're gonna fall out the window. Get back. Where's baby May May at? Okay, there's the crew. But uh, I wish these people were open, but it's right here beside the road, so. I'll be respectful and keep my distance a little bit. You guess, your guess is good as mine. Look at the little door handle here. I'm assuming this is an RV. Was, maybe it's just yard art. Well, no, that's a blower. I wonder if I'll get shot if I open this door. No, it's a camper. What you know about that? Straight up to your camper. <laughs> hey, mister. Good, how are you? I'm good. My name's Kevin. Steve Brubaker, good to meet you. This is your place? Yeah. Oh. Yeah, we just headed home, seen you take pictures and... and uh, do you mind? No, not I, at all. I, I, no, usually, I, I usually... Do you mind being on camera? I, got a, I have a YouTube channel for travel. Yeah? Yeah. And I, I normally ask just, people, but there was nobody here. I was like, I gotta, I gotta look. I gotta know can, what's in it. You can video it all you want. I don't know what to tell you. I mean, it's a 39 Federal, and I put the camper. You saw the inside. The camper's brand new on the inside. We just hadn't finished it. We put the barn tin on it. To, yeah. To make it look like it does. It's got a 454 Chevrolet with a overdrive transmission in it. It runs. Yeah, it runs and drives. And um, I just need to finish it up with a finish detailing it. Is that a blower motor? Blower? That's a fan. That, that's, that's the fan for the inside. Um, just, I mean, it's for actually staying in, and that's, that's just a vent motor. Turn around here. And uh, back here, do you know, you know much about teardrop campers? A little bit. Oh, I mean, wow. That opens up, and then I'd have to open the garage door, but that's where the kitchen's going to be. So you're going to get this out on the road. Oh yeah. Yeah. As, uh, Do you mind if I open this door? No, no, no. I've uh, traveled a good bit, but I've never been to this part of uh, Alabama, and I tell you, Mentone over here is beautiful. Yeah, yeah, that's quite a touristy um, place up there. Did, did I say it right? Min Mentone? Yep, yep. What what's the highway that comes through Mentone here? That's 117. That's right, 117. Uh, so you're gonna have this on the highway. Yeah. We we go we do cruising the coast. Have you ever been down there in the Biloxi deal? Uh-uh. 
Woo. and it looks ratty just like the rest of the truck and I, I left it that way on purpose but you see I had a custom radiator built for it just so it still fit inside the shell looky looky but uh Wrong runs one. and drives just fine believe it or not <laughs> what kind of front ends under it and this is the chassis is a 91 Chevrolet dually one ton dually I lengthened it about, if I remember right, about 18 inches to get the back wheels to clear right. the doors uh, going into the camper. But it's all it's all 91 Chevrolet drive truck. Running drive, running gear. Yeah. Okay. What what's the body? That's a Federal. Now see, I had never heard of a I've Federal until I federal. found this truck. Federal was really big into dump trucks and garbage trucks. Um. Yeah, when I found it, I, I swore it was international, but and the guy, we yeah. kind of went round and round. I said, so does uh, international build federal? And he kept saying, no, federal builds federal. Yeah, I think I think this will buff out a little, little, tur <laughs> little, tur <laughs> little turtle wax. I think it's perfect. Yeah, I do too. Those, those rear fenders are 47 Dodge front fenders, and... Um, and I'm going to use regular headlight buckets for tail lights. You know, they, they kind of come out like this. Yep. And uh, can we open this they're, side? They're just, yeah. Yep. Yeah, I'll open the you, other yep. side. You never know what you're going to find on the side of the road. I had to turn around. But I've had, a, yeah. I've had an RV channel on YouTube for several years now. Yeah. And, uh, I don't know, I film my little dogs, film our travel. If I find something neat, yeah. I film that too. Well, I guess a twin this would fit is, in here. Huh? A twin bed? Um, so a twin, twin mattress? Yeah, I think so. I think that's what it is. And that's what, I was going to put a flat screen TV. That, the outside of the truck is going to stay ready. This here was going to be nice with Pristine. flat screen TV, with a uh, wine glass rack and stuff like that. Um, I hear you. You gonna put an air conditioner on here? Yeah. The air conditioner will come through the back where the kitchenette is and everything. It'll be a microwave and all that back there. Um, yeah, I just need need about another month to finish it, and we've just been busy in the shop and haven't had a chance to do it. <laughs> I love it. Yeah, I've got a friend that was in a car wreck uh, about a month ago, and she's out of the hospital and got recovering i said well i'm going to go over and see her and i've never been in this part of the country but i've been I, I'm, I'm, I'm from athens georgia okay and she's over in scottsboro oh okay so i'm getting pretty yeah. close yeah all right i'm gonna yeah. pan around this thing so everybody can see the details Well, I'm glad we're still friends, or at least we're not enemies for me stopping. <laughs> no. no, it gets quite a bit of attention, actually. I figured if, yeah. you did, if you didn't want it looked at, you wouldn't have said it's close to the highway. Well, and, <laughs> well, we used to keep it around back, but then, like I said, you got, you got busy and, and uh, got crowded out back. There's oh. some other projects around, too. Well, uh, that that um, Acura Legend there has a 383 Chevrolet in it with a 90s Ford rear end. That's another project that's not done. What are you going to call this one right here? Does that have, have a name? Up with anything. All right. Well, I'll let you and your wife go. I want to thank you for. Good meeting you. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. I want to thank you for yep. being on the show. And the wolf pack saying, hey. He said, holy cow, how many are there in there? <laughs> we think, fella. We that's Tucker. Hey, hey. That's hey. baby May May's. May May? And that's Martini. Martini? Yep. Hey, hey. Yeah. Yeah. We like dogs. Yeah. We like dogs. <laughs> yeah, Tucker likes everybody. Okay, Steve, I got brand new bumper stickers. This is the new style. Okay. And, uh, a lot of people put them on their RV or you put them on your truck or stick it on your window at home, however you want to do it. Or Sounds great. Yep. 
I appreciate it. And Steve just told me that uh, he built this to play with, but he also, he's got it for sale. Yeah. So I've got a lot, you see the, the other Pontiac sitting over there with the chop top. I've got too many projects started and I need to get rid of some of them. So it could be bought. All right. Um, I'll get you to give me your, your information and then yeah. they can contact me. Then I'll contact okay. you if they're serious. Okay. You got a dollar figure in mind? Yeah. Uh, right now. Right now it's $10,000. i am figuring it's probably going to be worth about twenty five when it's done. All right. How about uh, we give them your email? That way. That's, I was going to get you a card. Okay. You guys are a hoot. You gotta wait, wait right there now. Thank you, ma'am. That goes everywhere, huh? That's where I live. Okay, Steve. What's the best way to reach you? Um, Performance Specialties in Hammondville, Alabama. Okay. Phone number. Email is proform22000 at yahoo.com. That's proform22000 at yahoo.com. All right, I'm going to end the little video right here. Been riding along. Take a look here at Steve's truck camper. Never seen anything like it. But uh, I appreciate each and every one of you. And uh, I'll see you again soon. You guys take care. Happy bye -bye. travels.